Okay, guess what? We're rolling. Okay. So you didn't have a nickname for us today, right. so I selected one for you. Okay. I'm going to call you Jupiter. Okay. It's perfect. <laughs> you like it? <laughs> like it. <laughs> Hi, Jupiter. Okay. Um, you've got something going on with your finger here. Tell us what's happening. Okay, so I've had this uh, wart for about three years, and mm -hmm. off and on, and I've been trying to um, use medication myself at home, and it falls off, and then it always comes back. What medicines have you used? You don't have to use brands. Just tell us what kinds of medicines. So my um, my first one was a Band-Aid, mm -hmm. and it has a little circle on it, and I wrap it around. Okay. And I do it for five days straight. Right, right. Um, and then I have also tried the freezing kind at home as ah, well. Ah, okay, yeah. And both have not worked. Didn't work. Okay, so it would go away for a little while, but it doesn't go deep. And that's the problem sometimes we see with these little warts is that they're so deep that using the topical products that you can get over the counter just doesn't get deep enough to get rid of it. Warts like this, common warts are caused by, do you know what kind of virus it is? No. Right there it is. Hard to see. I hope you guys on, on the video can see. Human papillomavirus, HPV. Okay. There's a little over a hundred strains that we know about of the HPV virus. Some of them are the bad ones that we worry about, right, that cause, you know, cancers and things. But some of them, like this one, are just very benign, except it causes this kind of a little growth, and we don't like them. Okay. Jupiter, are you okay if we video your procedure for all our friends on YouTube and around the world? Yes. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to use the liquid nitrogen, and hopefully we're going to be able to get rid of this for you. Okay. All right? Yes. So we're going to do uh, two freeze-thaw cycles, and we're going to see if we can't freeze it and get rid of it. Okay. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to kind of just hold your finger right where I need it to be. Okay. And then you're going to feel a little cold. Are you ready? Ready. Here we go. That's one. I'm going to let that thaw for just a moment. Okay. And then we'll get it again. It sounds kind of bad, doesn't mm -hmm. it? Does that hurt very much? No, not really. It stings a little bit though, it stings. doesn't it? It just stings. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So you can pick up the HPV viruses, the common viruses, uh, doorknobs, um, you know, really any kind of surface, counter spaces, things like that. Uh, and, and of course from frogs. Seriously? No. Okay. Not seriously at all. <laughs> Not seriously. Okay, thank God. Not about the frogs. That's the My old... son loves to play with frogs. <laughs> does he get warts? He does? Yeah, but he didn't get them from the frog. Okay. Maybe. No, he didn't get them from the frog. He might have gotten it from you. Perhaps. Because you... Now, most of the time, by the time we reach adulthood, our immune system kind of recognizes these and will get rid of them. Um, they're actually old wives' tail techniques that, that do work, so they're not really tails. They really work through... So let's call them um, some kind of... <laughs> um, home homegrown treatment systems or plans that do actually work like putting a piece of duct tape across right. the work because what it does is it sort of stimulates the immune system the immune system recognizes it as being foreign and then it will get rid of it so usually by the time somebody reaches in your very young person so it just hasn't happened for you okay so we're thaw now thawed so we're gonna do this one more time are you ready, okay, ready. now this one may actually sting just a little bit more ready mm -hmm. There you go. That one did sting more, didn't it? It did. I was right. Okay, so that's pretty typical. So what we hope this is going to do now is just kind of turn red, grow a little bit, be angry for a few days, okay. and then it will shrink down, dry up, and it should peel off, but not come back. Okay. If it does, then we have to do this again. Okay. Okay, so if it does, you come back right away. Don't wait. Okay. So that should be completely gone within a couple of weeks. Okay, if, wonderful. If not... We'll get aggressive. Okay, okay. okay. I mean, to the point of amputation, if need be. No. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Jupiter, for letting us record your little procedure. Thank you. All right, so we're going to treat. You have some warts on your fingers here. We're going to treat. Uh, we've already used the pedophilin. We already tried the uh, the gel. Did you get the gel, or was it the solution? The solution. The solution, and you used it for the three cycles. Um, you know, three days on, four days off. Not three cycles, but weekly cycles, right? Mm-hmm. All right, and uh, did that several times and just no success, huh? Correct. All right, you know what I want to do on a try? We have this new macro lens. I want to get a close-up on these for everybody. So I'm going to stop for a second and put on the other lens. There we go. Oh, look at that. That's fairly disgusting looking. Can you see it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Put it Let's on try another one, the big yeah. one there, yeah. Ooh, that is awful looking. Yeah. That's what a wart looks up nice and up close.
All right, we'll take this all. I thought that'd be fun to look at. Ready? Okay. Oh, you want to use the uh, tripod? No. Okay, go. You go. Turn on. You on? We're not going to use the tripod because this is a pretty quick procedure. This is, again, this is Axis, and he's got some common warts here. We did a little close up on these, so we're going to freeze them. And, uh, well, are you ready? I guess. All right. <laughs> Don't crack. And. Don't cry. Don't cry. He's not crying. He's not crying. He's uh he didn't watch any of the football games this weekend. Gonzo, did you watch any games? No. No. I want to go eat at Friday's. What else you got? You got another and, one? And uh that little one. Right Teeny there. tiny one right there. Right there. Hold that camera still, little Gonzo. Yeah. I did not watch a single down of any football games this weekend. All right, let's, let's stop for a minute. We're going to let those thaw, and then we'll freeze them again. All right. So to answer your question, you just asked a question um, before we were uh, filming, you know, what, what happens with these. These will get angry and red, and they'll, they'll swell a little bit, and then they'll sort of dry up, and they should peel off. Now, here's the problem with, uh, with these warts. Are you ready for another treatment? Yep. Sometimes... Sometimes these dudes are a lot deeper than you think they are, okay? Which may be why, I know that stung, didn't it? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it almost kicked me. The, uh, it is probably the reason why these did not just, the uh, they didn't just go away with the pedophilin treatment, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, which is an antiviral therapy. Now, typically speaking, the reason why some people get warts and some people don't, and we're all susceptible to getting these when we're young, but at, for most of us, at some point, uh, our immune system turns on and it just eliminates these, okay? The body, is, the body is not recognizing these warts as being foreign tissue because they're not completely foreign, right? They're just changed by the virus. So your body's immune system hasn't caught on that, hey, we don't want these things. But eventually it will and you'll stop getting them. Okay. Sometimes the act of freezing them is enough to, to generate an immune response. Sometimes... Uh, just treating them with something, just continuing to apply something is enough to do it. But uh, in your case, even though we use the medicine, uh, they're still there. So hopefully this will work. If they, if it's not completely gone in a couple of weeks, then next time I see you, we'll do another treatment. They'll okay. be a lot smaller than two.